There are times when you wish you could remotely access your desktop or laptop computer from anywhere on the internet. Whether you need to remotely access a document, photograph, video, or even a software application, the Google Chrome Remote Desktop app allows you to quickly and securely connect to your computer from anywhere on the web using a computer, tablet, or mobile device. Hello everyone, welcome you on my 100th video on my YouTube channel. In this video, you are going to learn how you can remotely access your own computer. This is not a new video as you have already learned how you can access your desktop PC using real VNC. If you are not yet watched that video, click the i button to watch now. Before getting started, make sure you have already subscribed to my YouTube channel and also hit the bell icon to stay connected with my upcoming videos. The Google Chrome Remote Desktop is a free application available as both a browser app and a mobile app for both Android and iOS platforms. Scroll down. Here you see Get Started button is available. Now click on Get Started. It will redirect you to another page. Now install the Chrome extension. Now download Chrome Remote Desktop. Here you see the download is started. It will take time. Now install it. We have successfully installed it on my PC. Now close the pop-up tabs. Now click this icon it will redirect you a page. Here click on turn on. Set your desktop PC name. Click next set the 6 digit passcode. Now click start. Here you see we are online. Now download the app from the Play Store if you are an Android user. Make sure you have login with the same Gmail account. Here you see a killer appears. Now click on that. Now enter passcode and click connect. You can control your desktop PC from anywhere on the internet. The main reason I think it is best that is its support touch screen. Click this you see the magic. There is another ability that I like most. I think that impresses me a lot. You can access your friend's PC without a Gmail account. But the condition is you can access only just one time. Let's go to that website again. Now click here on remote support. Now here you see, is divided into two sections. One section will generate the code and the other one will access the code. Click on generate code. It will generate a code. Now send this code. When I enter that code, I got a VNC session. Try this by your own side. Share this information with your friends and families. If you have any doubts write below in my comment.